This is the Lock Picking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is an Abus Model 150 combination lock sent to me all the way from Switzerland by Andreas. This is the 5 digit 50mm version of the Model 150. I should note that Abus also made a 4 digit 40mm version. I'm not sure exactly when this was made, but I'm told it hasn't been made for at least 20 years, and given the fact that it says made in Germany on the back and not made in West Germany, we know it was post reunification. So, my best guess is it's from the 1990s. Andreas did send the combination to me, but it's inside of this sealed envelope. So, if we want to get inside, we're going to have to decode it. The method for doing so is easier said than done. You need to press on this top lever, which normally releases the shackle when the correct combination is entered. That tensions the mechanism against these code levers, which allows us to feel the difference between false and true gates. The false gates are shallow V-shaped grooves, and the true gates are deeper U-shaped grooves, which allow a little bit more play on the levers. Now, when decoding in this way, the more pressure you put on the mechanism, the easier it is to differentiate between false and true gates. So, I'm going to use this piece of stainless steel tubing for leverage. Okay, let's get started. I'm looking for the levers that are binding the hardest. And... I'm just moving from lever to lever, and if it's binding up, I move it. Unfortunately, you can't really see what I'm doing, but number one just changed from binding tightly to having a fair bit of movement. I'm guessing that might be a true gate. Number two is moving around quite a bit. That one's almost certainly a true gate. Number three, just tiny bits of movement. Let's leave him alone for now. Number four is moving around quite a bit. Let's leave him alone. Number five, just a tiny bit of movement, probably false gates. Okay, and it looks like we got this open. The combination appears to be 22412. Let's check that out. Two, two, four, one, two. They appear to match. So, Andreas, thank you very much for the very cool lock. To everyone else, if you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.